with some creative idea or a, a help for you people for your research work is or for the projects so come on the point in the video which I am demonstrating today is generally a fingerprint recognition using the PST algorithm so this is a graphical user interface which we have prepared for this project before starting this video I just want to tell you one thing that the fingerprint matching which we are using is totally different from the previous techniques I know you people are thinking that uh, how is it possible and uh, what will be the difference so let us have a look the previous systems which we are using for the fingerprint matchings are generally the feature extraction based but do you people know when we are using the fingerprint matching algorithms or the techniques or the devices when the fingerprint which we are applying on that of a finger if get rotated at any angle then it will not detect the right authentication but the algorithm which, which we are using today is generally PST that is polar harmonic transformation which help us in recognizing the fingerprint at any of the angle rotated so firstly I have to give the training image as I am taking the number one image as a training image next is to crop the circle circle is generally for uh, to remove its edges so that we can move the image at any of the angle during the training section and during the testing session next is to apply PST when I apply the harmonic transform it will uh, extract the features of the specific image so now as you see firstly here was the get training image now after performing this PST we have to get the testing image when I select a testing image from here if I select the number 3 as an input image firstly I am going to select the same image as image number 1 and applying the crop a circle now here is an option that you can rotate this image at any angle if I rotate this when I highlight this check this box I can change the angle also here I am using the 60 as an angle and uh, when I apply rotate angle the image is rotated at 60 degree now when I apply PST after the PST there is a box up here that is show result if it is detected with the database which we are using or training image then it will detect but the difference is only that the angle that input image is rotated at some angle when I click on show results yes it will show me the Euclidean distance and it shows that fingerprint is matched if I repeat this thing again I am execute this one again I am executing the same project training image same image as input crop a circle and applying PST now at testing image when I am selecting different image firstly I have selected the image one as it in training in testing now I have selected one as a training and third for the testing next is to crop the circle we want to rotate at some angle uh, as I am using 150 degree or you can say the same angle previously entered that is 60 degree when I rotate this at 16 degree and apply the PHT there is a button shows will show results fingerprint not met so you see when I previously given the image image number one as a training and uh, then for the testing the same image is given at uh, some particular angle rotated our system is that much efficient that it detect that fingerprint with the rotated features and similarly for the non recognized section uh, this is totally different from the input image obviously it will not detect so you see how our project is helpful for the rotation invariancy for the more details contact us on www.espr meet Deepak we'll be back soon with a new idea and new project